is we like to broaden the picture of what success looks like after high school. G. Douglas Bundy is a teacher in the Beaverton School District. My primary role right now is to support our middle school Future Labs program that we started this year. Future Labs is hands-on and gives students a chance to explore different career paths and opportunities before they hit high school. Picture a lab that has 20 totally different curriculum happening at the same time. And you're not doing the same thing as the table next to you. Things like structural engineering, uh, there's like engine repair, uh, architectural drafting, culinary arts. It's kind of a wide gamut. Bundy says for decades, emphasis on CTE or career and technical education has taken a back seat to parents and educators, often pushing a four-year college education. I think we are all part of uh, a very well-intentioned effort to give our kids success. But college isn't the right fit for everyone. They don't know that these are viable careers um, in many cases that are uh, high paying, high demand, creative and fulfilling work. Uh, everybody thinks you got to get a four year degree to go make a lot of money. Well, it's not necessarily the case. That's Tanner Scott, a former Beaverton student who now works for Vigor Industrial in North Portland. So I'm part of the project management team here at a uh, ship repair facility. Scott says the trades can be lucrative. He's able to support his family off of one income, and often people can get paid with on-the-job training. If we can kind of help guide some kids towards trades a little more that don't necessarily want to go to the four-year path, everybody would be doing a lot better. The goal with Future Labs? To open up the world of possibility for kids instead of adhering to a one-size-fits-all approach. The goal of this experience is just to figure out, do you, do you like that thing over there? Giving them permission to explore something that either they didn't even know existed or maybe they never thought was for them. The middle school opportunities are basically tied to further opportunities that kids can explore once they get to high school. And this is just one example of a program that has popped up just this year. But in recent years, neighboring districts have also employed similar programming. For instance, Salem Kaiser, a new program from a few years back, also for their middle schoolers and also highlighting career and technical education. Back to you. I love it. All those skills are so important. Christine, thank you.